Yo, what, what, what up? It's Razor Pop la. How about the tension from the opposite sex? Has it, has it changed a little bit? Um, I guess so. <laughs> I'm nervous now. Um, yeah, but I, I guess I haven't fully um, explored that because since I came back, I've been like so busy. Yeah. Um, but I, I am aware, like when I walk past, and I guess I am an observer what I, in whatever that I do. Uh, even when I'm walking on the streets, I'll be looking at people and then realize why the people are staring at me, stuff like that. And then, you know, I, I do realize that. But it's always like unnecess- unnecessary, like, it's always all the api api all things there. You know, <laughs> nice. Okay, you've been uh, quite private about your relationships. Um, can you give us an update? Are you seeing someone? Are you getting married? Are you already married? You've been away for like Don't four know, years. Don't know, not telling. Cannot. That's cannot. It. Okay, mom's the word. I'm looking for sugar daddy thanks. No, okay, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. How long have you been gone? Like specifically, four years, five years? Six. Six years? And mm. what were the reasons for leaving Singapore? Um, it, was, it was a lot of reasons. Um, we had wanted to move. Don't ask who we are. <laughs> we had wanted, we, we had already assume. planned. We were already planning to move. It was just finding the right time. And um, uh, at that stage, my dad was still around. And um, so when, when, when dad passed on, it was the perfect autom- opportunity to move. Um, it was also at that stage where I wanted to do something new. I pretty much was exhausted and I wanted to do different stuff and uh, experience new stuff and new lifestyle and meet new people so we love Australia and yeah so we moved You've been a jazz singer for, for some time now um, was that always your main goal to be the jazz singer growing up? Um, not necessarily jazz um, singing has always been a personal passion like if you ask me you know like acting and singing and hosting and being funny and stuff like that what I like most I would say is singing because it's what I grew up with I mean I grew up in a family where my mother would cook in the kitchen and she'll sing you know that kind of thing as a, as a personal passion um, I come from a family of, of musicians too so it's a natural um, progression um, but singing was um, something which was never really explored when I was in Singapore it was never an op- a good opportunity it's always singing with hosting or singing with acting so when the opportunity come, came to um, sing jazz and standards and Motown on the ship, I grabbed it. And plus, the um, it, Holland America had never hired an Asian uh, singer before. And yeah, so I'm, I think up till now, I was still the first one. I was still the only one. So yeah, I'm pretty pretty happy about that. Yeah, how was the experience so far? It's amazing, mate. It's just... I, I can't, I can't, I can't explain it. I and mean, you, you literally have to be there. It's once in a lifetime. Does it get tiring, like being on ship, you know, day in, day out, night it, 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 it is exhausting. I mean, yeah. what kind of work is not exhausting? That it wouldn't be work. Um, it's not play either. But the fact that you 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 mix it with travel, you're seeing new places every day. You you seeing new faces and and people appreciate what you do um, and you're playing with such good musicians from around the world it's it's just you know priceless okay so are you going to carry on uh, jazz singing um, not so much again? jazz singing I, I love to sing I, I actually love to sing all genres of not rap <laughs> all genres not rap <laughs> all genres but not rap I cannot, do, cannot make it um, I love to sing all genres of, 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 of singing but um I think it was just like, it's just one of those things where one day, you know, you wake up and you realise, I think I've had enough of this. I think I've had, I want to see land, you know, travel so much. So yeah, so I, I, I took a two years sabbatical from the ship. And here I am, back to the circus.